Gerald? How's the poem? Could we do this tomorrow? Too late. You'll have to improvise. Master Dandelion, you're to play at my wedding. Milady, Geralt and I have devised a short poem for two voices. Care to listen? Uh, what? Proceed. His lips sealed, his eyes blank, his breast stone cold, his heart has ceased. Still in this world, yet no longer apart, who is this man? The deceased. New life comes as hope springs true, his soul shines by memory embraced. The dead returns to the land of his youth to seek his beloved's face. His breast heaves, yet cold it remains. His lips move, his eyes engrossed. Return to the world, but detained by death. Who is this man? A ghost. Stop! Stop! Selena killed me. My soul shall know no peace until I am avenged. Alina, it's me, Selina. As you can see, you have been avenged. Selina, don't blame yourself. I know you never intended to kill me. I'm filled with regret. Tis justice. I am damned to wander the fields at night till the end of time. Perhaps. But if we were able to lift one curse, I see no reason why we shouldn't. Will you help, Witcher? I'll try. Why did I save Abigail? Were her honor or virtue threatened? No. Because the law was being broken? No. Did I choose the lesser evil? No. The Reverend and his flock made a choice. I'm a witcher. I neither judge nor punish. I solve human problems. Not always using a sword. Driven on by the wind as I am. Why do you disturb me? I'd like to help. So one exists who is not indifferent to my fate. What is this? A wreath of immortelles? Crown me, white haired one. Free me. Go in peace, Selena. You have suffered enough. <laughs> 